In this video, we will see how to set configuration parameter for real time simulation. simulation. Okay, means in MATLAB configuration parameter we have to set it differently for real time simulation or for RT lab. So, first solver, what kind of solver you have to select? It's fixed step solver is mandatory, okay? So, remember this thing fixed step solver is mandatory. And okay, there you, you can find this setting simulation configuration parameters, maybe it differ different position in different uh, version of MATLAB but it will be in simulation configuration parameter okay and these are the things you have just look carefully so set stop time to infinitive okay it's like maybe uh, if you don't if you don't even uh, set it infinitive sometimes when like uh, your model is like not that much complex that time it will be maybe okay but when your uh, model is complex you must have to select stop time to infinitive otherwise you will may face like overrun problem okay so you will not get the uh, value result that you want from real time simulation and okay that uh, fixed step variable okay fixed step variable is must and solver uh, you can choose any as your wish what you want to use as solver for your model and fi fixed step size value in second okay uh, remember one thing if it is like it's better if you put at least uh, fixed step size minimum 10 microsecond minimum 10 microsecond it's uh, like uh, it's also compulsory for um, real time simulation it is better try to uh, run your model with at least means minimum 10 microseconds you can make it more than 10 more than 10 is like easier to run your model if your uh, like parameters all all other parameters of your model is set to 10 microseconds okay so these are the things you have to uh, uh, set carefully otherwise you will not get the good result or maybe you will not able to run your model with RT lab and one more thing uh, before running in RT lab every time you should uh, at first you should run your model in art uh, MATLAB okay so after running in MATLAB means if you uh, your model is not able to run in MATLAB then you can't run it with RT lab okay because RT lab and MATLAB is like um, it's work together so from uh, RT lab your uh, from RT lab that uh, your model will be open through MATLAB okay so if this video help you little bit subscribe this channel this will motivate me to make more videos on this topic of real-time simulation and for more videos of course subscribe this channel because i am going to upload some more conceptual videos uh, on real time simulation okay thank you guys